Water Music Launch Day 2021. Uh, it's another beautiful day. It's been 10 days on the hard. I uh, did a lot of work this time. Had to polish my whole sides because of um, particularly nasty uh, winter we've had here. There's a lot of uh, streaks from the rain. And the rain tends to be quite dirty in this area. We have a big road nearby, the motorway, and also there's a chemical factory down the, uh, down the river. So I had to spend uh, two and a half days uh, polishing the holes and they've come up very nicely. So I'm pleased with that, but it was a job I wasn't expecting to do this year. But I'm glad I've done it. good. This year I got quite a lot of painting done uh, on the underside of the boat. I was uh, very pleased to get that done. It's been a few years since I managed to do that. But really it was in good condition anyway. It was just a facelift. I've also done some work up on the uh, trampoline, putting a bar on the aft side of the anchor beam, which uh, allows me to attach the trampoline to the bar instead of just a rope over the anchor beam. So, yeah, it was a good. Uh, 10 day session but I'm very very pleased to be going in the water now so here we go rudders painted and Andy fouled new water music sign on the aft beam to do now is <laughs> get up that mast, clean off the spreaders, get rid of the winter spiders and get the sails on. Then I can relax. Shocks, nothing stuck, which is nice. Everything looks good, and in we go.
Can you um, grab it and pull it over? Okay. Okay, engine started first time. Good news. It's always stored inside during the winter and winterized by the yard. So I have no problems with it. Okay, the hoist is going away now. Uh, we're free to move out anytime we like. So I'll just let the engine warm a while. Then we'll be gone. There's my engine blowing away nicely. I've done my dockside checks, uh, forward and reverse. Everything's good, everything's connected up properly. Christine's getting ready to uh, slip the lines. And then we'll be off to our berth. Beautiful day. Oh, but it's been a tough morning. Well, it's evening on the launch day. And uh, we got in absolutely no trouble at all. It's quite an easy berth to get into. But if you make a mistake, there's a scrappy bollard thing waiting for you. But uh, I was prepared for it. And of course, we're not very far from the uh, rocks. Water level is very high at the moment because of the flooding upriver in Belgium and Germany. We're just getting used to the wildlife again. The coots and the grebes are all still nesting and they've got young. Very interesting to watch. Anyway, there's water music ready for her first adventure this summer. And I couldn't be happier. Directly in front of water music is Green Breeze. A very nicely built Richard Woods Eclipse built entirely in form sandwich constructed by Julius and Marlene to a very very high standard beautiful boat but 20 years of their life gone into it he's just finishing off the Treadmaster on his decks. Uh, he's got his vacuum bag machine going to keep the uh, Treadmaster sucked down onto the decks while the glue sets. And in a few days he's hoping to get out and have his first sail. <laughs> 